One of the things that I hope people will take away from them, from the book, is the idea that we can't go on having a world society where the operative word is more. More this, more that, more consumption, more automobiles, more TV sets, more dams, more uh, acreage under irrigation, uh, more population. Uh, we just can't do that. Uh, ex exponentially impossible. Uh, but getting people to think about the fact that less might be more uh, is a difficult thing. I, uh, in the United States, a 2% reduction in the average consumption of the typical middle class family in the United States might bring about wonders. Um, and we're doing, we are seeing some developments. We're using far less water than we used to in the United States, largely because of a growing water consciousness and new techniques and technologies in irrigation. But that's one thing. The other thing is, is that um, we have to realize that water issues are international issues. There's an international linkage to this. Um, the case close to home is this trans... Uh, a uh, continental pipeline that the Canadians want to build from the tar sands of Alberta down to um, Texas. And um, it's going to go right through the heart of the Ogallala Aquifer, which is one of the biggest aquifers in the Great Plains of the United States. And if that gets contaminated and the wells that are used to uh, irrigate farmland in the Midwest, uh, the, the jig is up for agriculture. And are we willing to sell out our aquifers so that a few oil companies can make a fast dollar.